Today we're going to take a look at a powerful Vim command, the G command. The G command lets you run any other command on lines containing a given pattern. Super useful in many situations. Hi, my name is Marco. Let's get started. So I just told you the G command lets you run any other command on lines containing a specific pattern. G stands for global. The basic syntax of the G command is colon G slash pattern slash command. By the way, for a list with all X commands, type colon H X hyphen commands. But let's actually see the G command in action. In this file, we have a list of CLI tools and their modern replacements. Let's say we want to see all the original tools in this list. Just type colon to enter command mode, G, then a slash, the pattern we want to search for. So in this case, we want to see all the lines containing original. So original, and then another slash and P, which stands for print. Nice, here's a list of all the original tools. Actually, if you don't give G any command to run, it runs print by default. So let's try that again. Enter command mode, G, original, hit, whoops, I can type, hit enter, and we see the same list as before. Let's try another command. As I mentioned before, for a list of all the X commands we can use with G, just type colon H, X hyphen commands, and you get a nice list with a short explanation what each command does. Let's say we want to delete all the originals so that only the replacements are left. So again, let's enter command mode, colon, G, slash. Let's use original as a pattern again. Now we want to use the delete command. We can also shorten this with a D. Now all the lines containing the word original were deleted from the buffer. Powerful stuff. By the way, tell me in the comments if you like these shorter Vim tips and tricks videos. And also you can suggest other topics we might cover in the future. Let's undo our last command. Now suppose we want to do the exact opposite. So run commands on any line not matching or not containing a given pattern. That's where the V command comes in. It's the inverse of the G command. So let's say we wanted to get rid of all the lines that aren't really timeless. So all the lines that don't contain the word timeless. Let's enter command mode again. Type V slash timeless. This matches all the lines that don't contain timeless. Another slash and let's use the delete command again. Hit enter. So this leaves only the line you see right here. Timeless. Like and subscribe. I think it's a fun line to keep, right? But let's undo this yet again. Let's say we wanted to do a little bit more complex stuff. For that, we could combine the G command with the norm command. Let me give you an example. So I want to add something to each line of the replacement tools. So let's enter command mode again. Colon G slash replacement to match the correct lines slash norm and now we can use any normal mode command first we have to do a space then let's do capital a to go to the end of the line a space and then type uses rust by the way and hit enter that's only a relatively simple command but i've got another video covering the norm command in a little bit more detail click here to check it out thanks for watching see you around and take care